All right, Tim, thanks. So um, I'm going to pull up the Marco Polo app now. And what this app is great for is everything that anybody ever wanted with FaceTime, with being able to leave people FaceTime messages. You can do that with the functionality of Snapchat. So if I were to pick on Ruru here and then, um, um, you know, you can see all the different filters just by swiping and stuff like that. This one looks like uh, one of the memes from America. And then um, also, this is my favorite one. This one lets you create like a cartoon image and stuff like that. So if I were to hit the start, it's obviously leaving a message. There's no time limit like Snapchat, but what you can do is you can write on people. You can also change the different um, voice filters too. So right now I have the helium filter on and it sounds really cool to the other person. Definitely turn on the macho one because I like to be the macho man. Yeah. And then there's also the robot one too. Now you can also draw on the person. If just pick the color, draw on and stuff like that. And then you can also turn the camera around. But it's awesome though, is that now that I just recorded that, I can actually play it back too. To start, it's obviously leaving a message. There's no time limit like Snapchat, but what you can do is you can write on people. You can also change the different um, voice filters too. So right now, I filter on, and it sounds really cool to the other person. Definitely turn on the macho one because I like to be the macho man. Yeah. There's also the robot one too. Now you can also draw on the person. If just pick the color, draw on and stuff like that. So yeah, so that's basically it. And then it, the full message will stay, and then they can, um, they can watch it later. And it also saves a message too, right on the app. So that's the Marco Polo app. I definitely would recommend it to everybody. Talk to you later, Tim.